under Trump, this kind of government will perish from the earth. I don't mean to scare you. <laughs> no, no, wait, maybe I do mean to scare you. If Trump returns to the White House, you can kiss these freedoms goodbye that we all take for granted. And elections, forget about it. That's over. That's done. Says the guy that is literally talking outside of a court where they're trying to imprison uh, the future president. If he gets in, I can tell you right now, he will never leave. Really? So why did he leave the first time? <laughs> I mean, he, he left the first time. So why should I believe you that he wouldn't leave? Because history says he left. <laughs> right now, he will never leave. He will never leave. You know that. How do I know that? I mean, I'm just going by track record and he did leave. So how can I know that? You know that. He will never leave. Now I wonder why this guy is so, so invested in this. Could it be that it's uh, something to do with the Epstein list or something? I don't know. But there's something. He's very invested in this. So this was funny too. Democrats, you are gangsters. You are gangsters. You're washed up. Fuck you. <laughs> He's like, you're washed up. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're washed up. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're a little You're a softy. You're a nobody. Your movies suck. You're trash. You're trash. You're done. You're done up in the Yeah, people seem uh, very upset with this guy. So he did come back and he was a little bit more honest here. First of all, everyone, please put on your masks and keep your distance. Some of us are really weak and fragile. And I don't know why they made this podium so high. I told them I'm coming <laughs> straight from the bathhouse and didn't have my platform shoes with me. I'm speaking to you today because I'm a scared little man, a washed up actor with lots of skeletons in my closet. <laughs> People like me need Joe Biden in power, not because he's any good, but because he enjoys the same sick perversions we do. Lots <laughs> That's great. I mean, I love that he's being honest now. Good, but because he enjoys the same sick perversions we do. Lots of dipshits think I'm smart because, uh, you know, I used to be able to memorize lines, but cock my head to the side and squid with a New York accent. In reality, I'm just a mook. M O O K Uh I'll be honest, Donald Trump scares the living shit out of me. I've always been <laughs> jealous of him. He's a, he's a real man, a true New Yorker. He walked the walk, talked the talk, and like Sinatra, he did it his way. I, on the other hand, only pretend to be tough and powerful <laughs> on a movie set. If Donald Trump was in front of me right now, I'd punch myself right in the face, get down on my hands and knees, and beg to blow him. If Trump gets reelected, sickos like me will be permanently banned from the circle of trust. I'll be stuck pumping blue milk from Mark Hamill's tits in a gay porn parody of Meet the Parrots. I'm begging you, vote for Joe Biden so I don't shrivel up and die. So now I, I respect him again because he was honest in this little press conference right here. So I like Robert De Niro now. Uh, Hopefully he keeps it this way, you know, keeps being honest like that.